damn it, Boozer, your arm's not gonna be fine. Son of a bitch. I gotta find something for his arm. I'm not taking Boozer's bike, I gotta get to my... ...line before it gets dark. Always need this. What the hell? Boozer, are you awake? Yeah, Dick. What's up? I just saw someone sneaking around the safe house. What the hell? What's he doing? No idea. I'm gonna follow him. See if there's some more where he came from. Deacon out. Coming. Spread out. Find them. Come on out. I know you haven't moved. He's hiding. Get him. Move it back. I need cover and fire. No. No. Move it back. This'll do. I found the camp. Just a few drifters looking to move in in our safe house. Like we were seeing before, it's time to start thinking about heading north. Let's get your arm fixed up and then worry about hitting the road. I'm gonna be heading to my bike, deacon out. Ah, oh, damn freakers. There we go. Oh, shit. Move, move. Run, run. Oh, damn rain. If it's not the freaks, it's the goddamn rain. Why is it always raining? That's it. Come on, baby, where the fuck are you? 
This is it. This is where we left it. My bike's gone. Fuck! Damn it, Copeland! Hey! You're from Copeland's camp? Where the hell is my bike? Hey, stop! Why, God damn it! I didn't take your bike, man. I swear. I'm not gonna kill you! Stop running! You gotta ask Copeland. I don't know nothing. Hey! My bike! I didn't do nothing! Oh, God damn it, all right now I'm gonna kill you. Boozer, you there? Yeah, get your bike. Nope. Copeland's men got to it before I did. I'm heading to his camp. Deacon out. Stole my bike! You know nothing about that. You gotta go talk to the man. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's where I'm headed. Hey, Manny. Hey, I haven't seen you in a while lately. You've been too busy to notice. Nose down. You work hard, they feed you. Yeah, camper's life. Yeah, camper's life. I read a book once, Zen and the Art of Bike Repair. You ever read it? No, I didn't have a lot of time for books back in the day. Yeah, I ran a shop, farewell. Made all the grease monkeys read it. Being a mechanic requires great peace of mind, it said. Try working on an empty stomach. That'll focus your mind. Man, I'm looking for a bike. Yeah? Oh, oh, oh. You don't want that one. Why not? It, it just came off the truck. I mean, some dumb son of a bitch left it out in the shit. Rusted up good. It rode hard, too. The fool that rode it didn't know shit about bike. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Shot the hell of this one. I mean, we just partied it out. I mean, it didn't even have a fuel pump. We could have used oh, that. Man, fuel pump like this one? O okay. Like this one, Manny. Oh, okay, okay. See, now, when I said fool, what I meant was the fools that brought that bike in, see, they didn't tie that shit down properly, so they left it, like, rattling around back there. Deke, and... let's talk. Looks like you had some trouble. You got hit hard last night. Uh -huh. Ripper's game. Twice now they've been up here. Some say looking for you and the loser. Out in the shit, folks say a lot of things. Folks around here take care of their own. They go enough days without food. Well, you see how it is. Lake not holding out? You get a fair amount of trout. Lake's fed by snowmelt. No one left to stock with fish. They're gonna run out sooner or later. Like everything else. Hunting out here with the old man. We build deer blinds out here. We put down salt licks below us. Pick them off clean. Some winners had so much venison we couldn't eat it all. I didn't think that was legal. Deer baiting back in the day. My old man had only one law in the United States Constitution. He could only see us now. America. Land of the free. We are that. Saw Leon the other day. Yeah? 
He was bringing me something. Is that right? Folks here in a lot of pain, Deke. Oh, Leon. Doug said that he took off. No one's seen him. Mm. <laughs> Tell you what. You find his stash. You bring it to me. To me, Deke. You do that. Well, we'll see what we can do for you. The bike that your men stole, that your men parted out. Salvage, Deke. Salvage. All right. Mm -hmm. I'll try to keep that in mind. By the way, nice hat. What? No, this one. Don't you ever touch Now, hold on. Leon wore a hat like this, didn't he? Coat, I swear to God. Don't. You want to do business in my camp? You start doing some runs for me. Poop. Ah, shit. Okay. I'm here anyway. What do you got? Now that's more like it. A group of drifters has been harassing my supply runs. They've moved into the radio tower west of O'Leary Mountain. Isn't that your backyard? No, it's not, but uh, I'll take care of them. I thought you might. I just want to say how sorry I am. I, I didn't know, I swear. Do you have any idea how much time I put into that bike? It was a drifter bike, Manny. I know, I know. I I'll make it up to you, I swear. I, I put together a new one. <laughs> you call this piece of shit a bike? I know, it's not. Look, I'll keep an eye out for, for more parts. I'll hook you up, I swear. Okay, and what about my custom gas tank, Manny? You know, the one that I got for my dead wife. You gonna keep an eye out for that one, too? Jesus, Deke, I'm sorry. Just get the fuck out of my way. And what? Look, Manny, it's done. Wait a sec. I'll open it. Jesus, this isn't a goddamn bike. Booster, you there? Yeah, Deke. How you doing? How's the arm? Like I said, I'll be fine. Uh, I'm still gonna head to that Nero checkpoint, find some uh, sterile bandages, uh, ointment, and something. Sure, whatever. I'm gonna go out. Make sure the mountain's clear. Those are, no, no, those are third degree burns. You stay there, you rest, okay? I'll, I'll be there as soon as I can. Um, I guess, uh, I could... Yeah, yeah, I guess... Yes, I guess I'll see what I can find. I'm down! God damn it!
fuel can. Sterile bandages, sterile bandages, where the hell would they keep this shit? Yes, sterile bandages. Just what the doctor ordered. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. How hello. What's this? Nero tank. Ah, some sort of a Injector of some kind. Ugh, why the hell not? <laughs> Steroids. Is that what this shit is? Boozer, you there? Boozer, goddammit, answer me. <sighs> He's not picking up. Where the hell is he? Hey, John. Let's go. When you get to the tower, my radio uplink has been shut down. I'll pay you for the store. So these men, you know them because shutting down Radio Free Oregon seems kind of personal. Goddamn right it's personal. They used to be a part of my camp. Seems they didn't like them. Stealing, raping, murdering. Well, maybe they're like me, just tired of listening to your paranoid truth or bullshit. St. John out. One more thing. When they left, it appears they may have stolen some automatic rifles and a few shotguns. Watch yourself. Jesus, Coke, thanks for the heads up. I do what I can. Go about. Do what you can, son. Hey, Boozer, I, uh, found some shit for your arm. 
Boozer? Oh, shit. Boozer! Hey! Oh, ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, shit, Deke. Could have blown your goddamn head off. Look, uh, let, me, let me see that arm, huh? No, no, I got Come this. Come on, let me see that look, arm. I got All it. All right. <sighs> Deke. Thanks, brother. Look, I'll, I'll be better, okay? I'm gonna be fine. 